Hello, hi. Dumelang, dumelang, di chomi. Ninjani, I hope you're good. And, yes, I really hope you're good. Honestly, when when we are asked this question, how are you? Most of us, I think, si pendula, and then that's it but honestly speaking how are you how are you babes how are you unjani unjani babes so so i'm at work right now i'm at work but then i am done with my lessons and the healing j i'm bored so i decided uh, 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 i've always wanted to to record a video like this hey so it's it's wednesday today hence why i'm doing a bit sporty and stuff so i decided to sit down and have a chat with myself and with someone who might just come across this video hey it's nothing it's 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 it's, it's nothing um serious I'm not, I'm, I'm not trying to be serious in the video but okay, the matter that i'm the matter that i want to discuss is a very serious matter which is a matter that has to do with mental health uh some of you might know that Last year, beginning of last year, which is like first him last year, I decided to start a YouTube video and I was like, okay, I want to have friends online and stuff or share my life, whatever, whatever with with uh, my friends online and stuff. Okay, so I'm fine. But then soon after my, my YouTube, I went... I went MIA soon after the Galile YouTube video. I went MIA and it was bad, guys. It was bad. I'm gonna try show you my pictures now. Over from around March last year, March April last year, but then didn't journey and then show you the, my pictures from March uh this year. I've gained so much weight. Mostly we think that people who are going through the most and not take care of themselves. But babs. And also we think that they want to be in bed all day with their curtains closed and stuff. But now with Umgoam was a total opposite so with me i was i always wanted to be around people so that i don't think a lot i, I the one thing that i did though was to eat a lot i ate a lot of junk food i found comfort uh in junk food i was never a person who had a sweet tooth i was never someone who just sit and crave a sweet crave a cake crave crave a chocolate i was never that kind of a person but ever since i was binge eating and eating a lot of sweets i never wanted to be alone i was always around people when i was with people i was the one who was laughing the most Can I help you? Um, you see from my sister, can you Okay, I am back. Sorry about that. So <laughs> let me <laughs> let me tell you this story. So after escalating at our school. Learners are not allowed to bring their phones to school because one, they take pictures of one another, they spend a lot of time on socials and they don't focus on their books. So one of the things that we try to do so that they try and like focus in their schoolwork is that we do not allow them to bring their um, phones to to school. So Ukbangaba, there's a child or a learner that will have a problem that would make them need their phone. We say to them they must uh, bring their phones to one of the teachers and the teacher keeps the phone for them and then 
uh do whatever they need to do at the time they need to do it so it's not like but so they they can bring the phone if they really need to use their phone but make at least even if it's one teacher away so what happened today is Puff lando it didn't start today it's been happening for quite some time so i think we have a problem of electricity in some part of this rural area that uh, our school is in so some of the learners from that part of the rural area they bring their phones to school to charge them so uti when you get to class in front of your class you have phones a lot of phones charging and then i told them that they mustn't do that because it's a form of uh, uh disrespect phones are not allowed and you bring your phone only to charge it so i told them not to do that so i went to class today and then i and i found phones charging they this is why i took them and then i took them to the principal's office so that they are kept safe so they've they've been begging me to to give them their phones back so as i was saying and i'm so sorry there's a lot of noise now because there are people doing our fans so so sorry about that but game oh and girl, we are gonna be safe from easy and chicken running around our school at least we are gonna be safe from that so okay guys i was still telling you that nah, my goal was not the goal that would be seen by people. You'd never see me sad. You'd never see me not wanting to socialize. You'd always see me happy, smiling. Not even one person could tell that I was going through the most. No? Sharp fine. See where I'm going with this. A lot of people expect that people who are goishering, you will just see them that they are goishering. No? And Kesana this is this is not good me manditi sambe this is not really a good way to deal with umgo because people maybe they are going to treat you, they're not going to treat you as nice as you need as you need them to because you are go you are go issuing and stuff which is why gengoku it's always always good to be kind to people ne? be kind to people be considerate because you really really don't know what they are going through you might think that they are okay because you see you see them smiling laughing and you might just take it for granted but no they're good they're smiling they're laughing but you don't know what they're going through Deep down in their hearts, you don't know what they are going through. I've seen this case and I'm now, or I've experienced this firsthand with me because people did not know that I was going through the most. Not that people treated me badly, but they just didn't know that I was going through it. So imagine Omnia Umtu Raf Atini Atini Kanti, they are triggering something. You know, yeah, people don't owe you anything. But Kesana, can people be kind to other people? See, <laughs> so can people be kind to other people? No, that case, I'm not even asking. Go with your own cool video and stuff. I was just sharing in the book, but people might seem okay. Gandhi, deep down, they are not okay. So because you won't know Uba Umtu is going through something or don't own, rather just be kind to people in general so that you avoid being the cause or so that you avoid being the trigger of whatever they're going through. So with all that being said, hey, I'm not going to go through the details of what made me go up, but okay, one thing I can tell you is that it was really really bad i'm not gonna say that i am 100 percent okay now but the mere fact that i am able to face uh life better the mere fact that i can spend some time alone the mere fact that i can see that that binge eating has made me gain a lot of weight and i don't like it not that i'm saying there's anything wrong with people who are thick there is nothing wrong with that but for me i really really don't enjoy it so i went from a size 32 to a size 36 yes that's how bad it is i've gained over 20 cages so 
I am uh, recording this video because I want to share that with you. And also, I want you to take... I want to take you on my journey of recovering. I'll say recovering because I want to get to be myself again. I know I'm not going to go back to being that old self because I've grown and what I've experienced has really changed me. It has changed how I think. It has changed how I look at things. So I'm not going to, I'm not going to go back to being the old me. Come on. That is gone. I can never get it back. But um, I want to be happier, you know. I want to be happier. I want to be at peace. I want to shed some weight. Not all of it because I don't really want to go back to being a size 30, you know. I don't want to go back to being thin because I was thin. So, But I just want to go maybe be a size 32 close to 34 yeah so uh, that's what I, I i i i want to achieve hey so what i have started doing one is i i go for therapy every three weeks so that is going good and another thing is that i've started fasting so i started fasting i tried fasting starting from march ne? i'll show you my app March, February, March, I tried fasting, ne? but guess seemingly I was not ready uh, and I fell off and then I kept gaining more and more weight. So I, 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 I took a decision that I'm going to give myself at least 21 days to try this fasting thing again because honestly speaking, if I'm being honest guys, Landoye diet and stuff, it didn't work for me and i don't want to force myself to eat certain foods and not eat certain foods at least not now so what i am doing right now is i, I am intermittent fasting so for for the past 21 days i'm on day 23 now i've been intermittent fasting and i am proud to say i lost five kgs baby <laughs> five kgs baby five cages that's a win and i'm running with it and guys because i have seen that it's working and i feel so good i feel so good i feel so light i think it's working for me and i think it's good for me so what i've decided is that i'm gonna continue intermittent fasting for 31 days for a, a full month and then dibone how i feel about it and if it's on clear then kudos i'm gonna continue with it and i'm gonna try making it a lifestyle you know how i do with gym a gym it's a lifestyle to me i feel bad for not going to gym and also the mere fact that i don't i don't particularly have goals when it comes to each gym makes me feel good because Galog, one thing about having goals is that it keeps you going having a goal keeps you going and then when you reach that goal then sana speed in the energy starts dropping because you have reached the goal that you had or okay, the goal that you've set for yourself so it slows things down when you reach the goal it's slow excuse me it slows things down and then you find yourself back where you have started as goals in Tetangazo, it gives you goals as a weight. If you said, I'm going to gym, I want to lose and be a 60 kgs. When you get to 60 kgs, nothing motivates you to go to gym again. Is Anna and this normal? Am I too loud? <laughs> am I too loud? If I am, I am very sorry. If I am very loud, I am so, so sorry. So yeah, guys, that's what I wanted to to tell you about Kesana, can we be kind can we be kind to other people between because we we don't really know what other people are going through hey and also i don't think i don't think you need a reason to be kind hey i don't think you need a reason to be kind you know but get, people tend to be kind towards 
umdu only when they know that oh shame they're going through a hard time you know but in the bana people must practice being kind you don't lose anything with being kind hey you really don't lose anything so betunana i like i like having an online community because sometimes okay well for me i don't have like a lot of friends so i don't really have uh somebody to keep me accountable hey i don't have an accountability partner ne? and also yeah yeah over a slab of chocolate okay over a tub of ice cream you know okay you will bond over a packet of chips you know those habits that you those bad habits that you have with your friends i think we all do so the friends that i have around me they have those as a habit as funio and funa ukuz limit has been they are good people love them love them love them loads but then some of the habits not good for what i want to achieve so this is why again i'm taking it online that exactly like account accountability partners you know not saying that every time maybe i post something online then must be i still intimate and fasting but in general, people to talk to you know yeah uh that's it so i'm gonna continue intimate and fasting and maybe maybe i'll try to have like a a a diet feed for my goals you know because right now i am eating anything but in moderation you know if i want to eat a cake a piece of cake i will have a piece of cake but i will not have i'll only have the piece of cake during my eating window you know and i've managed to lose about five five kgs doing that so imagine if i were to eat clean imagine <laughs> imagine if i were to eat clean so you know what I'm gonna challenge myself to eat clean. I'm gonna challenge to eat my to, oh, to eat myself for bad home. We do mellow. <laughs> so I'm gonna challenge to I'm gonna challenge myself to eat cleaner, eat more greens, you know, eat more at home. But I've been doing that. Yo, another thing, guys, I was eating out almost every day. I'd eat KFC because we only have KFC and Japanese Kizana Rural Staloko. So I'd eat KFC. I'd eat Japanese like almost every day. You know? I I was still going to gym, but you know if you are going to gym and still your diet is bad, gym it gyms then no ba unga gym every five minutes of the day but if your diet is bad you can't out train a bad diet so yeah betona yeah so that's me that's my story that's what i wanted to tell you today but guys as any kind and also i think maybe i owe you even I owe you my special like the people who started following me when I started my channel last year. Sana na kala so to ba that. He? Batong da kala so to ba. The pela emoyen. That was it, guys. Soon after I opened my channel, something really, 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 really bad happened to me, and I've been go showing since then. I'm a better person now. I feel a lot, lot better. I feel a lot, a lot better. And guess uh, so. And guys, don't think that I was not trying to to create content. I would try, hey. <laughs> I try to create content, but guess Anna, kunga yenzeki, kunga yes lando your propose because because you know what you know what what's bad about this whole thing is that i proposed yes 
I proposed. If you can go through my shots, you will see that there is a proposal video there. I proposed, asked people to be my friends, and then I was a bad friend, and I just went MIA. That is not good. It's not good for a friend. It's kind of like saying, I forgive. I understand that from the other gender, but Sana from me, there's a lot of to my tummies. It was not good. But yeah, guys, yeah, that's what has been happening to me. And um, that's what I would like us as people to do in general. Be kind, you know. You lose nothing. So yeah, that's me, guys. And then the video that I'm going to make next will be a video of me trying to eat clean for seven days. For seven days. So eat Londole. I'm going to show you what I eat in a week um to lose weight and then we will see if it works or it does not work okay okay guys so Bendite, i've gained uh, a, a lot of weight and i was about uh, i gained over 20 i gained over 20 kgs and i was like 80 kilograms imagine it hold me it hold me as 80 kilograms and uh with intermittent fasting for 21 days i managed to lose five kgs of that weight so it's londoleo i think i want to lose 10 more kgs yeah i think i want to lose 10 more kgs and then i don't want to lose any more weight after that so yeah guys thank you for listening to me talk a lot <laughs> because there was a lot but i enjoyed doing it hey really did so yeah thank you for listening to me talk a lot uh and Thank you for watching. Hey, those of you who stayed for a whole year without any content, without any explanations, thank you so much, my friends. I don't know any other languages except the three. But guys, I much appreciate it. Hey? I appreciate it so, so much. Thank you for watching and bye. I'll see you on my next one.